Hi everyone and welcome back to another video. So I've done quite a number of liveries on my past videos and I would like to say a big thank you for all those who have watched, liked, subscribed and even commented. I just want you to know that I appreciate each and every one of you and um, even the spam comments uh, that kept coming in with all the videos. By now, most of you would know um, how to do the glitch already. You've seen it so many times in those full length videos. So today, um, in this video, I'm just going to show you some of the more interesting ones which I have not shown yet. So at least you will know which livery you need to buy in order to flip it uh, to the correct one. I will also leave um, some comments in the description so that you will actually know um, what vehicles can actually carry these liveries or what, what vehicles you can actually flip the, uh, these liveries onto. So do read the description before you start flipping the liveries uh, so that you don't waste your time trying to flip it on a vehicle that does not support that livery. So just watch till the end to understand it better. First up is the pink and green camel on the Vagrant. When you actually purchase this, you will be able to flip the skulls livery onto set one vehicles. So set one vehicles, I'll leave a list uh, in the description. You can take a look at that. It also flips onto the Comet Safari as you see here. Pretty interesting livery when you actually look at it up close. Next, we have the yellow and blue camo livery. And when you go through the glitch and flip these onto the set one vehicle, you will get the knuckle duster livery. Not the most interesting, but nonetheless uh, pretty unique. You can actually try changing the background colors to see um, how much better you can look. I know I'm not good with that, my taste is actually pretty off. Moving down the list of liveries from the Vagrant, we have the orange um, shade camel. So when you actually do the glitch and flip these, you will actually get um, something like this. Um, some call it the bully livery and some call it the conveyance livery. The icons in the livery are pretty interesting because um, they actually come from another game um, from Rockstar it's called Bully. So if you have played that game, you may be interested in this. Now the next one I'm showing you is the blue and green camel. And when you flip or glitch these onto set one vehicles, uh, it comes up with a pretty interesting livery. And it just plasters your entire vehicle uh, with the Rockstar logo. Naturally, this vehicle or livery is called Rockstar. So if you're a fan, then this is definitely for you. I'm not that big of a fan, so um, I, I, I actually won't be using this much. So the last one I want to show you for today is using the Urban Warrior livery. And I'll be glitching this onto a vehicle that very few people will take notice about or even heard of. That vehicle is a Seminole Frontier. You can buy it from Southern San Andreas. And the livery that we flip on will be the Forest Ranger. Once you have this livery on, no matter what color you change, right, you actually don't see much of a difference. It's always that color. I would say this livery is an acquired taste. It's either you like it or you don't. It just looks to me like a big mishmash of um, dead or fallen leaves on the forest floor. That's it for me today. Thanks for watching and I will see you in the next one.